And we're back. Before we start, make sure to subscribe because I'm trying to get 500 so I can apply for a partner because everything else is met. Please appreciate it. Also, Discord link is in the description. Best place to reach me. Third, best comments. Go into the comments section of the Discord for everyone else to see. Thank you so much. Let's get right into it. Then. Listen, yes, prior to the Faunus Rights Revolution, more popular known as the Faunus War, humankind was quite, quite adamant about centralizing Faunus population in Menagerie. Now, while this must feel like ancient history to many of you, it is imperative to remember that these are relatively recent events. Why, the repercussions of the uprising can still be seen to this day. Now, have any among you been subjugated or discriminated because of your Faunus heritage? That, no one's going to answer that question because that is, like, a teacher wouldn't ask that in public. That's that's highly offensive. Wow. Holy crap. I didn't even, I didn't even consider that. You can't, it, this guy would be reported to HR. Dreadful, simply dreadful. Remember, students, it is precisely this kind of ignorance that breeds violence. I mean, I mean, I mean, just look at what happened to the White Fang. Now, which one of you young scholars could tell me what many theorists believe to be the turning point in the third year of the war? Yes. The battle at Fort Castle. Precisely. And who can tell me the advantage the Faunus had over- I was the know-it-all in school. I was. I was, I was that person. General Lagoon's forces. Hey! Miss Art, finally contributing to class. This is excellent, excellent. What is the answer? Uh, the answer? The advantage uh, the Faunus <clears throat> had over that guy's stuff. Mm-hmm. Their uh, eyes. Binoculars. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny, Mr. Ark. Cotton, perhaps you would care to share your thoughts on the subject. Well, I know it's a lot easier to train an animal than a soldier. You're not the most open-minded of individuals, are you, Cardin? What? You got a problem? No, I have the answer. It's night vision. Many faunas are known to have nearly perfect sight in the dark. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I don't remember that ever being used. Hold on. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna write that down. And if it doesn't come up again, I'm like, that's that's a waste of exposition right there. Because I don't remember them having good sight coming up. General Legume was inexperienced and made the mistake of trying to ambush the Faunus in their sleep. His massive army was outmatched and the general was captured. Perhaps if he'd paid attention in class, he wouldn't have been remembered as such a failure. <clears throat> Mr. Winchester, please take your seat. <laughs> you and Mr. Ark could both see me after class for additional readings. Oh. Now, moving on. Oh, they had you go on things. ahead. I'll wait for Jean. You two have been struggling in my class since day one. Now, I don't know if it's a lack of interest or just your stubborn nature, but whatever it is, it stops now. You've worked hard to gain entrance to the school, and we only accept the best of the best, so I expect you to act like it. Did... History is important, gentlemen. If you can't learn from it, you're destined to repeat it. Pages 51 to 91. I want an essay on my desk by next class. Now, run along. I don't think I ever had to detect that. Little pal! <laughs> ah, you know, I really will break his legs. <sighs> I have an idea. Here, come with me. Uh -oh.
Pira, I know I'm going through a hard time right now, but I'm not that depressed. I can always be a farmer or something. No! Oh. That's not well, why I brought you up here. They made a suicide joke. Like, I don't know. I feel like if... Can we say suicide jokes are A-OK, -okay, right? Can we joke about that? Is that something that's, like, fine? Or is that something that we're, we're going to get up in trouble for? <laughs> Jean, I know you're having YouTube a difficult a time beef. in class. And that you're still not the strongest of fighters, whoa, so... Whoa, whoa, is that, is that Cardinal now? Frick. I want to help you. What, is, is he eavesdropping? What? We can train up here after class where no one can bother us. You think I need help? Yeah. No. No, that's not what I meant. But John, you just said it. Why are you more John, everybody needs a little push from time to time. It doesn't make you any different from the rest of us. You made it to Beacon. That speaks volumes of what you're capable of. Nope, he inherited it. You're wrong. I, I don't belong here. That's a terrible thing to say. Of course you do. No, I don't. I wasn't really accepted into Beacon. What do you mean? I mean, I didn't go to combat school. I didn't pass any tests. I didn't earn my spot at this academy. I lied. I got my hands on some fake transcripts, and I lied. What? But why? Because this is what I've always wanted to be. My father, my grandfather, and his father before him were all warriors. They were all heroes. I wanted to be one too. I was just never good enough. Then let me help you. I don't want help. I don't want to be the damsel in distress. I want to be the hero. John, Sean, why are you being I I'm tired so of being the lovable idiot stuck in the tree while his friends fight for their lives. Don't you understand? If I can't do this on my no, own, I don't then what good am I? Nothing. You're worthless. Just leave me alone, okay? If that's what you think is best. Man, looking back at John in the early seasons make you really hate him. <laughs> oh, Jean. Oh, Cardinal was there the whole time. Cardin? I couldn't help but overhear you two from my dorm room. So, you snuck into Beacon, huh? I gotta say, Jean, I never expected you to be such a rebel. Please, Cardin, please don't tell anyone. Jean, come on. I'd never rat at a friend like that. A... Uh, a friend? Of <laughs> course. We're friends now, Johnny boy. Yeah. And the way I see it, as long as you're there for me when I need you, we'll be friends for a long time. <laughs> that being said, I really don't have time to do those extra readings Dr. Ubuck gave us today. Think you could take care of that for me, buddy? That's what I thought. Don't worry, Jean. Your secret's safe with me. Okay. Well, um, I didn't. I did not remember John not being accepted into the school. I really didn't. Also, doesn't that plop? Like, I don't really see how far that's going to go because didn't they say something like once you're accepted, they do like Ozpin specifically chooses by whatever. Like, I don't even see a problem with this, honestly. Sure, whatever. He's not in. Okay. Sure. I will see you in the next one. I don't have much to say on that one. Like I like Cardinal's a bully. Wow. Ooh. Bye. <laughs>